be the change you want to see. We thank Catholic Charities for doing that in our community. We thank Chef Makita Freeman Woods for being part of that change as well. And being here just to give us a recipe or two for the holiday. Yeah. Chef Makita, how are you? I'm doing amazing. How are you doing? I'm doing good. good. It's been a while since we've seen yes. you. You now, Executive Chef Director. I am now the there. Director of Common Table. Yes. Still in my role as Executive Chef and Instructor. You are busy. Yes, you are busy. busier than busy. Yes, ma'am. That's a very accurate <laughs> statement. That's so, very accurate. Catholic Charities of Louisville, Common Table, before we get mm -hmm. to cooking, if, it, if it's okay, sure. talk about everything that you Absolutely. do and why it's so important. So it's important because we're able to create pathways for people to move themselves out of poverty or put themselves in a better position by getting the entryway into culinary arts. And so we're providing eight weeks of basic culinary arts job training. And then after you complete the um, culinary program, we help with job placement or we connect you to other organizations or people that can help you achieve your goals if that's entrepreneurship. Yeah, because you, you, if you see someone that is not making it, not yeah. able to feed themselves, not able to find a home for mm -hmm. themselves, well, they can't do that if right. they don't have a way to make money or exactly. or a, a way to, to, to get there. Yeah. It's impossible. Exactly. So how do they do that? Tell us about that there is a, a, a program that you have. Yes. How do they get there? How can they join that? How can they learn about it? You can join our program by visiting the website, which is cclou.org. We have monthly information sessions and that's Catholic Charities Lou CC Lou yep Yep, cclu. There we go. Dot org forward slash common table. Uh, we have monthly informational sessions. You can go on there, click, sign up for an informational session. Come on into the kitchen, spend some time with me, take a tour, fill out the application, and then we'll get you started. We have classes starting the first Monday of every month. Um, so we're always looking for new students to come in and join us. Now you you hear she said informational sessions. Yes. That's not saying you sign in your life no. away. That's no. not saying somebody going to make you do something. Informational, Informational. session. Just to see if that fits. Absolutely. See if that should right. fit. Because we want to make sure it's a good fit for you. Yeah, because you right. may not want to. Absolutely. Because a lot of people, you know, they have misconceptions of being a chef. Everybody thinks, you know, it's just sprinkle here, sprinkle there. I want to be a chef. But when you get in the common table, you're going to do the real work. Yeah. And it's a good view to see if this is really what you want to do. If I can't, like, when I retire here, yep. be a chef. Come to the class. That's what I would Come do. Come through. I, I would. Yeah. Because I love to cook. <laughs> okay, so what are we what are we doing? So today we're going to do just a spin on cranberry sauce. So um, I love fresh cranberry sauce. Yes, and that's where we're using all fresh ingredients. So I have us a um, stock pot here that we're going to start off by adding our fresh cranberries. Now you can use fresh or frozen, but why would you use frozen when you can when you can have fresh, fresh. right? Especially now, in they're the everywhere, season, right? So we're going to add in three cups of cranberries. This is a very simple recipe. It's just don't want to come out of there. We're going to leave that there. We ain't going to fuss with him. And then we're going to add about a cup of diced mangoes. That's the first time I've ever seen putting mangoes in cranberries. Yes. And then we're going to use about a tablespoon of minced ginger. Minced ginger. Mm -hmm. Ginger has Fresh a little ginger. bit of spice to it. It does. Yeah. I no like a little spice. No spice. And then we're going to go in with a cup of orange juice and a cup of sugar. I love this. It's the holidays. We got to sweeten it okay. up now. So is this... Is this like the cranberry sauce that you put on your plate when you eat? Yes. Okay. Yes. Like when you eat for Thanksgiving? Absolutely. This is just like that cranberry sauce for Thanksgiving. We're just giving it a little spin. A little spin. I feel like it's more of a, Freshen a, a it up. fresh Caribbean kind of flavors when we think mm -hmm. about um, the mango and then that fresh ginger in there. And so you put everything in the pot and you yeah. just let it simmer. So and the cranberries will like pop. Absolutely. They're going to pop. We're going to let this simmer for about 45 minutes and it'll get all nice bubbly and then we have our finished product right here um, and we have it paired with um, some toast points and some herb cream cheese. Now is that what you just made? Is that yes. there? This Can is I what taste we just it? Made. Absolutely. Uh -huh. Absolutely. I love my and job. And so we wanted to provide like an alternative after the holidays. Yeah. You don't want any more turkey and dressing. Uh -huh. You can use your cranberry chutney paired with brie, a herb cream That's cheese. Really good. A little of your roasted turkey you have left on some toast points and you have a delicious snack. Have a glass of wine. And the mango is in there? The mango is in there. Okay. 
I don't taste them, you know, I, mm -hmm. like I was looking for what yes. I know mm -hmm. as mango, yes. but it doesn't stand out yes. like it's mango. It's kind of in the then. background. You get, more, the of, background. You get more of the ginger You get more front. of the ginger. Yes. You get more that of the ginger up what front. I'm tasting. Absolutely. The ginger. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, that is, is so very good. In this season of, of giving, of holidays and all of that as you all work at Catholic mm -hmm. Charities uh, of Louisville and at the common table. What do you all want us to just kind of slow down and, and think about? Um, think about food as a connector. Like food is something that brings us together. I think of food and fellowship it goes hand in hand. So when you come to the common table, not only are we going to teach you some culinary skills, but you're now building community. So you're part of a community. You have opportunity to fellowship and network with other people who are like-minded. So it's a good opportunity all the way around. Uh, I, I guess, too, uh, because this is where my heart lies as well, think of those who are not able yep. to sit down at that table. Absolutely. Because number one, they don't have a table. Mm -hmm. And number two, they don't have food. Correct. And number three, maybe we can work to help those who don't have that table or that food uh, get to where they need to be. Yeah. One more time, if someone is looking to get out of that situation, to find a job, to find yep. more than a job, a career, Absolutely. what can they do? It is cclou.org. Sign up for one of our informational sessions. Also on that website, you can find more information about our soup subscription, which is how we support this amazing program. It's through our six-week soup and bread subscription. Um, so we're having really amazing um, homemade soup that's produced by the students that goes out with a loaf of artisan bread. So you can find out of that, about that on the website as well. Oh my goodness, we should have talked about that because I, I can come back. What? Well, yeah, because you all make the soup. <laughs> yes. And you make the bread. We do not make the bread. You, no, that comes from. We um, partner with the amazing local bakery. Right. Wildflower Bakery. Yes, Wildflower. And the, yes, and they make amazing. And you all, bread. but you're able to register for that yes. soup and that bread, and it comes to you, and you get to eat it yes. up. Yes. Mm. Mm -hmm. And right. it's the perfect time of the year for perfect soup and bread. Time of year. Now is the time. All right, and we'll have you come back. And talk about that again, too. All right, there you go. CCLU.org/slash/common table. Wonderful things that they do. When we come.